It's beer o'clock on Reload Craft Beer. Today we've got a brand new beer from Siren Craft Brew and it's a bottle of their Hop Candy Double IPA coming in at 9.2% ABV. I am a big, big fan of Siren Craft Brew. I think they produce some of the best beers in the UK. Bottle opener. Let's get this bottle out into a glass, see what we get. Nice bit of smoke on the opening. Beer in the glass then. Oh, look at this. I'm gonna get it all in. Shall I? No, I won't. I'm gonna hold back. It might be bottle conditioned or. No, it's not. Let's throw it in. Okay, so what do we get? We got a slightly hazy, nice looking double IPA. Nice to have the carbonation rolling up the side of the glass, as you can see. Hazy amber color, very small one finger white head. Oh, should we just dive into this aroma? Cheers. Yeah, this is different. I mean, this is, this is in terms of different IPA. Um, let me explain. Recently, I've been drinking a lot of these kind of Vermont style IPAs, these cloudy, juicy IPAs. I like them. I think they're fantastic, but this is a little bit proper old school. I can tell just by the aroma. This is gonna have a smacking bitterness about it. And I just love it. I, I love that smacking round the chop bitterness. It smells like it's in abundance. Big, big orange peel, big pine, big grapefruit aromas. Can't wait any longer. Let's dive in. Hop Candy by Siren Craft Brew. Ah, ha, ha. Here it is. Boom! Stone of the Crows. Whacking great bitter sensation on the back of the palate. This is really, it's like a cat on the curtains. Really attacking my tongue, this is. Oh, it's 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 full on bitter. This is probably, I don't know, maybe maybe 90 IBUs, something like that, 100 IBUs. Oh, Yes, I love it. Stone the Crows. Stone the Crows. <sighs> Grapefruit, orange peel, fleshy blood orange, bitterness, pine needle, and then it's still tropical. It still has all that lovely tropicalness about it. The the mango, the citrus fruits, pale stone fruits. It's, it's got it in abundance. It really has. But it's, you can see it, it's like a Cheshire, I'm, I'm smiling like a Cheshire cat, isn't I? Uh, it, it's, for me, it's it's this old, I'm calling it old school bitterness. I mean, it's amazing, isn't it? How how far we've come with beer. How many different styles now of what we used to call American IPA. We should really call it New World IPA now, I suppose. That's the that's the the best terminology for it because you have New Zealand IPAs and you have American IPAs and you have hops from Australia, Galaxy hops, and and I, it, it's great, it, it, it's great. Um, and now you have different styles of IPAs, you have these these kind of Vermont IPAs, and you have these, these, these for me, these wonderful, wonderful, bitter, bold, probably 90 IBU double IPAs. Yeah, cheers to beers, yeah? Do 
Drinkability is fantastic. It's a, it's a really nice drinking double IPA. Not too big and malty and cloyny. It's still very very drinkable, very refreshing, nicely carbonated. The carbonation rolls off the tongue, pushes the beer on the inside of the mouth. But I, it's this, it's that lovely Simcoe hop, juicy, punchy bitterness that, that I just love about this style of beer. Nice biscuit malts to begin with, nice little bit of dryness on the back end, superb. So that's Hop Candy by Siren Craft Brewer, double IPA. Exploding with hops. Hop Candy leads with a Simcoe forward pine and evergreen aroma, backed up with deep tropical fruit and berry notes. Brightened with fresh lime. It's got fresh lime in it, fantastic. Do you really get that? Yeah. Now they mention it, yeah. It's it's really kind of sharp and citrusy, but then you get that bitterness on the back end as well that goes with it. Didn't get the lime, I gotta be honest. Uh, expect more of the same when drinking with more balanced tropical flavors in the foreground. Lupulin powder, oats, wheat, and no filtering mean this beer pours with a natural haze. Mm, yeah, I mean, 9.2% ABV. I'm gonna mention it, I'm gonna mention it. Uh, maybe it's just a lack of understanding on my part. I like hop pellets, I like hop flowers, lupulin powder, what's that all about? Honestly, I've seen it on some of the other British craft brewers. Um, I'm not against it. I'm not against it because this beer is fabulous. I just want to understand it a little bit more. So maybe some of you can comment in the comments box as to, as to what this lupulin powder is. Rating, Hop Candy, double IPA. By Siren Craft Brew. Looks great in the glass. Nice lacing, nice carbonation, nice look to the beer. I, I had a, a, a feeling I was going to give this beer a high mark all along. Um, I'm not going to take anything away from it for having lupulin powder in. I, I, don't, I don't really care. It's just I want to know more about it. 10 out of 10. 10 out of 10 from Reload Craft Beer. Please put your comments in the comments box. Subscribe to our daily beer reviews. Give us a big fat thumbs up. Boom! And cheers.